soon. Jackson. Yes, yeah, too. Knew we were coming. Just chilling out. What'd you think of that, Jackson? What a hit! We're on! Yeah. Alright morning team, welcome back 2020, first video, you might have noticed there's a few little differences, new intro, pretty sweet intro, and then also at the start of the videos this year I'm going to add a little bit of what I get up to here in North Queensland, and the start of this one you could see me and the fan band, we're up at Younglow and we're lucky enough that day to travel up there and we could see the platypuses. It kind of adds itself to today's video, today's video is a home movie made by myself when me and the young fella went up to Youngler Dam and spent the weekend up there. I'll talk to you a little bit more of it at the end, but right now, let's have a look at Youngler Dam. This is our front view. Camp for the night. <laughs> Moving over for dinner. Tyler just burned himself, that's great. Now that's fire. Okay. Don't burn yourself again. It's a nice little sunset too, eh mate? This is the last GoPro for the night I think mate. It's getting a bit too dark. I can only just see you. Good night. Morning, morning. Boat's right, still there. Sun's coming over. Everything's getting done that. The coffee's on. Milo. And then we are out of here, Tyler Tyler. Alright, this is us. Alright, the first spot was a bar stay. What have we got over here, Tyler? This looks promising. You're gonna lose a few of those type of casts. fish today. Time to pack up. Say bye to Youngler Dam, Tyler. Youngler Dam. Thank you. Alright team, I hope you enjoyed that little home movie of me and Tyler at Youngler Dam. I highly suggest if you get a chance to travel up to Youngler and you get the chance to stay at the dam that you do so. It's a really nice spot and I I know we didn't catch any fish but I've been told well there's big sooties down there so Tyler and I we will be back. Anyway, this was a different style of video. It was made with a home movie feel because I did it for a reason. Lots of people say, you know, Chris, what, uh, what software do you use to make your videos? And I say, listen, I use Premiere Pro. It's a really good software. It's, you know, a little bit hard to use, but once you get the hang of it, you can do some really cool stuff like you can even clone yourself, which is awesome. And then they go away and they come back and they go, Chris, I didn't really want something that difficult. I just needed something a little bit easier to use. Yeah, but you didn't tell me about this, did you? So after they come back and they say that's too hard to use, I say, listen, Adobe make another one, it's called Adobe Rush. It's a lot easier to use. And once you get on there, it navigates fairly easy. All you have to do is select your clips, trim them down to size, add some music, add some titles, and then if you want, you can even add a color filter at the end. And then hopefully that'll help you out. Thanks for clearing that up. No worries. Okay, well that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll be back again shortly. I'm hoping to pump out a little bit more content this year. I think I got three videos out last year. I'm going to do more than that this year. I already got like four or five just made ready to go. So hopefully we'll get them out in the next few weeks. So if you want to see them, make sure you subscribe. And um, yeah, let's do it. I'll see you next week and we'll do a That's Fishing. Until then, I'll catch you team. 
You know, at the end of the videos, I usually like to add something clever and funny at the end, but I've always wondered, what am I going to do when I don't have anything like that to say? Anyway, I guess I'll cross that bridge when I come to it.